back to another tasty Thursday. We're cooking something delicious. Ooh! Okay, wait, but before, before we cook and before we eat, you haven't seen this daughter yet. I talk about her all the time. I talk about all my kids all the time. You know that. I have like 7,000 kids. You know, you know, you know the deal. You know the deal. Look, beep, boop, beep, boop, boop, my kids. But. <laughs> Wait, you ready? Come, early. My daughter, Eileen. She's going to help me cook because she is the seasoning, the carne queen. If you don't know what carne is, that's meat. And then we also have. Caitlin, and you already saw her in the previous video. Go watch it. If you haven't watched it, I'm going to put it right here. Okay, so we're going to be cooking. Okay, so this is what we're cooking, guys. Ooh, what am I making? And in here, I know it's garlic in there, minced garlic. And then we got some olive oil. See, minced garlic, olive oil. You'll see what we're cooking. In la cocina de Irene. You know, when we're using sofrito in the mix, it has to be delicious. What am I making? What am I making? So frito, mira. Mira, look at how delicious. It's almost finished. It's almost finished. Well, I put it in the container, but in there it's almost finished too. This is the stuff that I couldn't fit in the container and I gotta I gotta use it. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? And if you wanna if you wanna know how to make so frito, I'm gonna put the video right here, right here, right here. So these are the seasonings that we're gonna use. Sazonador total. You already know. You already know. And then adobo. And then we have garlic salt. And then we have sazon. And then we have -na -na -na, pork chops. And before you guys get at me and saying, oh my gosh, you're eating pork chops. Listen, let me tell you something. I'm going to put the right here. Right. <laughs> Nutritional facts about pork chops, okay? Pork chops are one of the cleanest meats that you can eat besides chicken. And it has the most protein. So go check it out. Go eat some pork chops because we hungry anyway and we Hispanic and we haven't eaten pork chops in like how long? How long have we have eaten pork chops? It's been a minute. It's been a minute. Mm -hmm. Okay, so she's a seasoning queen. So she about to season this. She about to open it and season it. Wash your hands. Clean, clean the carne. Please. Don't eat it like that without it. Okay. Mm -hmm. You see that? If you don't know, now you know. Now you're learning how to how to actually clean your hands in the kitchen, guys. And then we're gonna clean the carne because that's what we have to do. Nails. Oh yeah, nails. Nails are good for all of these things. What are you ready for, Caitlin? Uh, Everything. The food? Yes. All of it to eat? Yes. All right, let's see how it's going. Let's see. Uh, look, don't get at me. I know it's ghetto. It's ghetto. It's ghetto. I know. <laughs> I don't have the tapa for the caldero. It got messed up. But, ooh, guys, I'm making some rice, huh? Yeah, this is the rice, and we got some habichuelas. Yo, when I cook beans, I be wanting to sing the song, Goya, habichuelas, Goya, más sabrosa con la sal. Okay, if you don't know it, I'm going to put it right here. I'm going to put it so you can hear it. Goya, habichuelas, Goya, más sabrosa con la sal. Like 70 years ago, right? <laughs> in the back of the back of the back of the back of the head. You see, look at that. Look at this, guys. If you don't know, you better, you better learn. You see that? That's how you clean the porchitos. Oh, yeah. We, we, we got distracted a little bit. <laughs> we forgot to show you. <laughs> okay, guys, look. She's seasoning. Okay, she put all that yummy stuff right there. Right, you saw what I put in there. Mm. All right. So, Eileen, how do you season the, the carne with your hands? Or do you put gloves? Or what's happening? <laughs> exactly. She didn't even have to say nothing. She didn't even have to say nothing. <laughs> See, guys, look. If you don't do it like this, you're doing it wrong. Wait, I can't. What? You don't do it like that, you're doing it wrong. Well, then it was good already. Mm -hmm. Let me prepare the salte. Mm -hmm. All right, so we're here. Eileen is washing her hands again. <laughs> yeah, Where's Kaylin? Kaylin, come here, girl. You all the way over here. My bad, y'all. My bad. <laughs> Okay, so thanks for everybody who watched our video with me and Caitlin, you know, doing our makeup. Now we're watching, you know, Tasty Thursday because it's, mm. it's tasty and you learn how to cook, you know what I'm saying? Um, you already know that um, at the beginning when we when I was making the, the beans, how to make sofrito, I put it up there. Um, I think I already taught you guys how to make rice. I don't even remember. But if I didn't, it's real easy. Like, I'll literally put the ingredients on there and tell you how to do it, right? <laughs> Because and if you don't know how to do it on the, on a caldero or a pot like that one, 
Do it on a rice cooker, guys. You'll be all right. It it's comes out okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. it's, it, Maybe not the same. It's the same. You just got to season it a little bit more. Yeah, yeah you do got to season mm -hmm. it more. That's true. That's true. That's true. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But we're about to finish cooking over here. We're about to look. Mira, mira what we doing. Look what we're doing. Got my little crusty, dusty pan. <laughs> I probably need a new one. Okay. And I'm going to put um, the stove at like five-ish. Because, right, we don't have like, it's like four and then six. Like, what the heck. And then we let the pan um, get a little bit you know, take all that water out, whatever, get dry. And then I'm going to use some extra virgin olive oil. Why? Because this is the best kind. The best. Okay, don't use any of that other stuff, guys, because it's bad for your health, okay? But the beans are doing good. The rice is doing good. It needs, like, I don't know, a couple more minutes left. All right, it's time to fry it. When you see, like, the, you know, the little bubbles, it's going to... Look, you guys, don't be afraid because it's going gonna, it's gonna to splatter. Oh, wait, it didn't splatter. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Okay, we're going to put them in there. Even though one of them should be doing this, Caitlin. Oh. But it's okay. It's okay. You going to do it, Caitlin? You going to take over? Yeah. All right, here. Take over. Put it in there. Let me see. I'm looking scared. I don't want the oil to pop out at me. It's not going to pop out. It looks delicious. Mm-hmm. Ooh, I mean, I mean, it doesn't because it's raw meat, but you know what I mean. You know what I mean, guys? It's getting there. We, yeah, yeah, yeah. We got to trust the process. Mm -hmm. We got to trust <laughs> the process. All right. I know. That's fine. That's fine. Okay, when the pork chop is getting nice and delicious and golden brown, you have to, you know, turn it over. And then if you want more crisp, which I love more crisp, you can turn it over again, like twice. So it pretty much takes pork chops, like, 10 15 minutes to actually make okay just make sure that you have it in a good heat right because you don't want to have any type of like bacteria or nothing right okay so let's look at the rice with my ghetto tapa but it's okay Woo! That is delicious. who's gonna taste it where's my taste tester kaylin oh <laughs> she was in the other room <laughs> and make sure that you guys you know Move the rice, okay? Get a spoon, girl. Right. Move the rice enough because obviously you want it to cook evenly, okay? Especially if you're not cooking in a rice cooker and you don't and you want to try cooking in a um, caldero. How do you say this in English? Caldero. caldero. I yeah, know. I don't know either. Robert, rice pot. What do you call I don't the, know. What do you call what she's cooking the rice on? I don't even know. A cauldron. <laughs> That's weird. Okay, I don't know, but let me, visit, it. let me visit my friend Google. She gonna visit her friend Google, and we're gonna let you know. All right, Caitlin, let me know if the, if we have more. If we need more time in there. Mm -hmm. It needs more time. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And Eileen is visiting our friend Google, looking yeah, up what I did. I don't know how to say this word. <laughs> oh, it's a cauldron for real. We are not witches. <laughs> A cauldron? Ew. I've never heard that word Me, in my life. No, it's 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 that black thing that witches use. That's that's what there are. The cauldron for the potions and stuff like that. Alright, alright, alright. It's cause this won't be a tasty Thursday unless we taste something. But my daughter has to leave, so the other food is not done yet. Oh, but this is done though. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna taste it. Alright, who's gonna taste it first? Take a piece what, and then. What am I gonna taste it with? Guess okay, so I just pick it up. Cut it. And get, give me a piece. Give uh -huh. you a piece. Give Ali a piece. Girl, what the heck? Why are you trying to be dainty? Why are you trying to be dainty? I don't want to oh. like lotion. Actually, the one oh, All right, All right ready? Mm hmm. Mm. Go make some, guys. Mm -hmm. But you know what? One thing, the secret weapon that you won't have is Eileen. I'm sorry. That's why she's sassing out of me. And you got to, like, get in there. Mm -hmm. Can't have me both. <laughs> mm, sorry, guys. <laughs> but I hope you enjoyed this Tasty Thursday. Here's all the ingredients of all the stuff that I made over here. Whatever the videos, you saw it in there. Everything is going to be linked in the description. Like, subscribe, do all that good stuff, whatever. Comment. Whatever you guys want to know next or learn how to cook so I can make it. Right, guys? All right, well, we're going to eat because I'm hungry. And this lies in garbage. So I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.